Deepa, welcome to my kitchen and today I am going to share with you how to make quick and easy kurma for dosa and idli. So you can prepare this kurma in just 10 minutes and uh, the interesting thing about this is you don't need any masala powder. We are going to make it using a fresh ingredient so it's healthy too. So let's have a look at the ingredient list and here I have roasted chana dal. I have taken around quarter cup of roasted chana dal and so you can get it at any Indian grocery stores. So quarter cup of roasted chana dal will serve for 3 people and for detailed ingredient list you can visit my blog and the link is in the description box. And uh, here I have tomato 2 finely chopped and onion cut into lengthwise. And uh, here I have red chilli, green chilli and curry leaves one spring and one tablespoon full of ginger and garlic paste and uh, some coriander leaves for garnishing. And uh, here I have oil and you will need around one tablespoon and this is uh, cinnamon and gloves. Um, you can take a uh, one inch uh, size of cinnamon and three gloves that is more than enough. And uh, here I have some freshly grated coconut I have taken around uh, three tablespoons full of coconut you can use a fresh or a frozen one but uh, I love to use fresh ingredient in my kitchen so this is a fresh coconut and here uh, so turmeric you will need half teaspoon of turmeric and half teaspoon of fennel seeds and half teaspoon of mustard seeds so these are all the ingredient list and uh, very simple and uh, let me show you the method now first uh, we have to make a fine powder out with this cinnamon gloves and roasted chana dal so place it in your blender and make it to a fine paste i mean fine powder and now uh, place a pan on your stove and add around uh, one tablespoon full of oil and one uh, once it is hot i'm adding mustard seeds around half teaspoon let it to splutter so once it splutter we can add half teaspoon of fennel seeds so you can see my fennel seeds also started to crackle and now i'm going to add my onion red chili green chili and curry leaves into the oil and uh, sort it for a while So now uh, you can see my onions are uh, nicely golden brown and now I am going to add tomatoes into this. Mix them well and uh, add turmeric powder around a half teaspoon. and mix them well and we need to cook this tomato till they are nicely mashed and to speed up the process we can add salt also at this point of time so now I am adding salt so cook this for around 3 minutes so that uh, the tomato will mash so now uh, my tomatoes are cooked fine and now I'm going to add my ginger garlic paste and uh, again cook this ginger garlic paste uh, for 3 to 4 minutes till raw flavor goes away. So at this point of time uh, while this garlic and ginger are getting cooked uh, you can make a fine powder out of roasted chana dal cinnamon and gloves and see to that you are making it very nice powder uh, now I am adding coconut into this
grated coconut and it is optional actually if you don't have you can skip and make this kurma even though it will taste great but uh, adding it would give you a nice flavor as well so try to add if you have coconut otherwise you can skip and now here is my roasted chana dal powder with cinnamon and gloves i have made it to a very fine powder and now i am just going to add a quarter cup of water into this and mix it well with the whisk so that there should not be any lumps in it and now i'm going to add this paste into tomato mixture and mix it well so now i'm going to add uh, around 2 cup full of water i mean half liter of water and mix them well and we need to cook this kurma now uh, for around 10 to 12 minutes and at this point of time we can add salt also so add salt to your taste and uh, cook it for around uh, 10 to 12 minutes so kurma is ready now i have cooked it for around uh, 12 minutes and it has thickened now you can see it's thick now even uh, if it is bit liquid while you are preparing this don't worry it will become thick once it started to cool down so you don't need to worry about the consistency and uh, now i will transfer this into a bowl so here is my simple easy and quick kurma ready to serve you can serve this one with dosa idli paneeram along with the coconut chutney it will really taste great and if you have any queries please feel free to post your comments and also subscribe to get more delicious recipes like this thanks for watching i will catch you soon with another interesting recipe until then bye bye from deepak sir